Hello dear students, welcome to Exeometric course. This video is the part of the solution series for CSIR net December 2019 and we are doing this problem 42 of your paper. So it's a problem from ordinary differential equation. So have a look. Consider the following system of differential equation. So see we have a system of differential equation and what question is asking then for the system there exist so the question is talking about the closed path all right in different reason question is asking us about the closed path now let us firstly try to solve this differential equation and then we will talk about the options later on all right now see this differential equation simultaneous differential equation that we have what i will be doing i will be dividing this with this equation all right so we have dy by dt is equal to this and we have dx by dt is equal to this. So I will find out the value of dy by dx. All right. So it will be dy by dt by dx by dt. All right. Now just uh, do it for the right hand side part. So if you do it for the right hand side part, you will end up with this x4 y5. 2x square y cube divided with 4x cube y square minus x5 y4 all right now what i will do i will just cross multiply them and then i will write it properly so if you will do that what you will get c from here you can choose your x square also common out so if you will take x square common out of it and x square from the denominator also then it will be cancelled now the same thing is for the y. So let us do firstly that, that if you take your x square common, see from both the things, you, you can take your x square y square outside. So you will end up with this x square y cube minus 2x, not x square actually, just 2y over, you will get this. If you will take uh, x square y square common, 4xy not y actually and from here you will get x cube y square all right this is what you will get now i will just cross multiply them and then i will write so see this is what you will get after the multiplication what i have done i have taken x common out of it and y common out of it and i have written it in this format why is this format uh, so important I will tell you now now what you can do you see you x square y square is over here and x square y square is over here so if you will choose it common what you will get you will get this x square y square now see I am choosing minus outside so what you will get y dx plus from here you will get x dy now let us try to write whatever is left so you will get 2y dx and from here you will get 4x dy whole square now see the important thing over here is this that this is the derivative of xy all right so now we are getting this information out of it now see this is x over here and this is y all right so you cannot integrate this term also with the same thing you cannot integrate this term because you have y over here and you are in you have to integrate it with respect to x what i will do in order to make this thing x i will just subtract with uh, i will just subtract with uh, x y both side not subtract actually i will just divide with x y both side so on dividing x y so on dividing x y what you will get uh, I think you will get minus x y d of x y all right plus 2 by x dx plus 4 by y dy this is what you will get now what I will do I will just take this uh, what I will do think this function like this that this is dt the thing inside the bracket is dt and the thing outside is t so this is actually t dt so what's the integration if you will integrate it directly what's the integration of t dt the integration is very simple it is 
t square by 2 all right so the integration of this will be 2 log x integration of this will be 4 log y all right now we will write it in the proper format so c initially i forgot to write c on the right hand side all right so on the right hand side you have zero so if you will integrate you will get this kind of constant all right so fixing those constant finally you will get this so this is the solution for the differential equation that we have all right now what i want you i want you to know the meaning of closeness all right closed path so let me write that properly for you so see this is the definition for the closed path so we are talking about a non-linear system so initially you were given with a non-linear system ODE so all right so if an, what this definition is actually telling us a non-linear system of equation has a closed path if it has a periodic solution all right also you can talk about the linear all right if you have a linear system then what's the meaning of closed path in that system so if the system is linear all right it has nothing to do with the question just for the knowledge purpose if the system is linear then it has a closed path All right if uh, then it has a closed path if roots of auxiliary equation are purely imaginary all right this is what we already know so in this case you have a linear system this is your solution now see it's not periodic all right so it is not periodic now because it is not periodic we can say that this linear system will have all right this linear system will have no closed path in r square because see reason uh, the thing is that if it happens that in a certain reason uh, your function all right your solution is getting periodic then we can talk about closeness but see this 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 function that this solution that we have is not periodic at all all right so because it is not periodic so we can say that it is it has no closed path in r square so it's a easy problem but but it depends on this thing that if you can find out a solution for this one or not if you can find out the solution for such kind of nonlinear differential equation then what we can do in order to find closed path whether it is closed uh, whether the solution for the system has a closed path or not we have to use this definition that it has to be periodic so because the function that we have is not periodic we can say that uh, we can say that uh, it has no closed path in r square so if you have any doubt regarding this problem you can always ask in the comment section and if you have any other doubt you can join our whatsapp and telegram groups links are given in the description part of the video all right so thank you